Hi guys, so I got some more items from Sephora, Beachy, and I got my Shein order in, and I believe that's it. So if you're interested in the rest of my Sephora haul, this is first impressions. I just got this in the mail and some clothing items as well, a lot of swimsuits and tees from Shein and um, from Beachy, uh, which is an online boutique. Just keep watching. I really appreciate it. Please like and subscribe. Um, moving on, next thing. So I'm gonna jump right in. So for the Sephora VIB sale, um, I picked up oh, I picked up the Sephora Favorites Deluxe Perfume Samples. So I don't typically pick up these type of items, but you do get a um, a full size perfume once you. I think you would use them all up. No, I think look, so. You get you just have to bring it in after you try them all. So it's like you're trying it. So it comes with Gucci Flora. Um, so there's like the bonus on Lumiere Cologne Bohemian Orange Blossom, which is supposed to be exciting. Um, so this was seventy five dollars, but it's one hundred twenty one dollars retail value. Plus you get a per whole perfume, so I feel like it's a really good deal. These perfumes are expensive. Um, so I'm gonna try the Chloe, the Clean Reserve. The Gucci Flora, uh, Nest, New York, Golden Nectar. None of these I've tried. Um, I used to I used to be subscribed to Semperd and I did love it a lot. I just haven't really subscribed to it recently. I don't know. I did really, really enjoy it. And I think it's a really great service. Obviously, I'm not sponsored, but um, it's just like a really, really great service. I got to try so many perfumes and they give like a decent size amount. So I totally would resubscribe now that I think about it. Um, I'm going to do this for now because I have like a few perfumes I want to go through. But it was really nice being able to try perfumes without like having to commit to a rollerball or like a whole perfume. So moving on to the rest. So there's Versace, Dylan Turquoise, you have Saint Laurent Butte, Black Opium, which I think I've tried before and is super musky. So I'm not really a fan. Um, and then the bonus, which is not available for redemption because probably way more than 75, is the Octelier Cologne. So I'm going to try all these out and get a full size of one of these. So it's like my first time in a while purchasing one of these um, fragrance scents of sets. I'm just, I'm not like the biggest fan of like buying um, perfume because it's just so expensive. So, um, but I do enjoy having it smelling good. So I'm going to show you another perfume that I picked up, which I absolutely love. Like I am so glad that I finally picked it up. It's my favorite. So I just want to give a quick update since yesterday. I am loving the Saint Tropez bronzing water face mist. I've just been spraying this on with my setting spray. So I feel like it has made my face bronzy, but not like obnoxious. So I've been liking that so far. And I am loving the LYS items I picked up. Side note, I did order more, which they're actually really like a good price for Sephora. So I picked up the highlighter and just like the same comes in the same shape as these. Picked up the highlighter and I picked up, um, what else? Oh, just like the lip. It's like the lip jelly. It was only like $12. So these are pretty reasonably priced. I believe they're like $20 each. Don't quote me on that. So I've been loving the bronzer once again. I just think this is a really like amazing formula and product for the price. And I just really like the names and like what they stand for. Like they're online only. So check that out. Been loving that. Quick update on the Gucci lip balms. I've been trying to love them. I'm wearing it right. No, actually I'm wearing the iconic London lip pumping gloss and not your baby right now, which I've already used up a whole one. It's just like a sheer baby pink, really pumping and a little minty menthol -y, but not too much. Um, this does still smell like new car smell. Like it smells like leather. And I don't know. I'm still up in the I'm still up in the air about it. I don't. I just feel like it's kind of like I feel like pretty bougie when I'm using it. Like at work, I'm just like, oh, let me just like smell like a new car real quick. Like, like it literally smells like leather, and I'm kind of like feeling it. Like I don't know. It's kind of like the set. It just like makes me feel like you know, like I'm doing well. Like I don't know what to tell you. Like it's just the set. It's it's not great, but it's also like a vibe. Okay, so moving on. Um, more Sephora items. So if you're like interested in the makeup portion, it's just like this part and then I'm going to move into, um, 
fashion so you can skip to fashion if you're interested or just like you know just click on the video whatever more updates real quick so i i use the lancome tinted doll ultra wear all over concealer today and yesterday loving that and i've also been loving the like i've been using them and i just like I, i've used a lot of concealers in my life so i kind of like know if i'm gonna like something or not like if it's gonna crease and make me look older like i'm like nah fam um of course i can't find it where you at bro where you at all right, well, it's the Lawless Conceal the Deal. It's like super light. I just use it right here to brighten, and I just feel like whenever I just need to pick me up, it just makes me look awake. So, let me on to the new items. I'm really surprised by how fast like things are like shipping. Like honestly, it's just like boom, boom, boom. And also, like they need to put a limit on how many things you can order. Real talk, like the sale needs to be over. <laughs> Okay, next. So I picked up the Orbe Straight Away Smoothing Blowout Cream. So I don't like love hair stuff. Like I hate buying hair stuff, honestly. Like I don't know why. I just like I need it, but like I just, it's just not as fun as makeup for me. So I've heard like really good things about Orbe and I like my hair to be straight and like, you know, like just shiny and straight because my hair, like this is this is my hair straight a little bit. Like it's it can be pretty poofy and it's like wavy and it's got some pink to it. So look at this, like what? Oh, you fancy, huh? Like, dang. I think I've seen this in, like, Saks and, like, Neiman Marcus. So I was like, let me try this out. Also, like, I look at this emblem, like, what? Okay. Distribute throughout damp hair section by section before blowing out. Silky smooth, a flat iron finish adds extra perfection. So it's also a heat protectant. So it's basically, like, a blowout cream and, like, a heat protector, which is, like, really clutch. Cool. Let's smell it. It's really thick white cream. Don't say anything. Um, the, the packaging came like all racky. But yeah, like I'm just really impressed with this apple. I don't know. It's like a little over the top and I'm feeling it. Next, I picked up the Sephora Daily Clean Refresh. Refresh Daily Brush Cleaner. So I'm like the type of person who's like, when I watch TV with my boyfriend, like I'm the person who's like cleaning my brushes. Like, I don't know, it's like very relaxing to me. It's like my knitting. So I usually use the Cinema Secrets and I, this actually has a really high review and it was 30% off. So I picked up the Sephora Daily Refresh Daily Brush Cleaner, but I have really high standards for brush cleaner. Like really, really high. Like it's gotta be like, this is the best one. The smell is horrid, but like this one is so, so good. Um, I have tried like the Elf one and like others and I'm just like, you know, like it has higher views. I don't know why because it didn't do anything. Like I, like I need my brushes to be clean. Like I love my brushes. So hopefully this passes the test because I have very, very high standards for that. Next, I picked up this blush. I picked up. I need to stop like talking while I'm actually like going through the package because it's really loud. Okay, so this is a Sephora blush in the shade Flirted Up. So this is actually. A, a blush shade, I believe, that uh, Leah and Janae talked about, and she said that Kylie Jenner talked about it, so it like out on the map. And it was probably going to be sold out. Why can't I open it? I'm not like the biggest fan of like single blushes because I feel like I have so many blush palettes. But yeah, this blush is apparently like amazing. And when she put it on, I was like, let me put it. Ooh, that's pretty. That's pretty, fam. It's really pigmented, has a mirror, which is like 10 out of 10 for me. That's pretty. Yeah, so I like this. I like this to shade Florida. i get you some before they out. Okay, so this I'm really excited to show you now. This is like really inspired me to film today. I picked up the Fenty Beauty Sunstalker Face Plus Eye Bronze. Face Plus Eye Bronzer Highlighter Palette. Okay. <laughs> All right, she did it all. She hit it all spots here. Like, throw a lip palette in there. We have, we got everything. So, first of all, like, I, I do like the bronzers for some reason. I don't, don't. I think I did clutter all the time. I don't know where they, where they are. And like, but I do like the powder. Like, they're not too powdery. They're really, um, good formula. I have not tried her highlighters. So this is what it looks like. It's a lot smaller than I thought it was gonna be. Like, and it's. Uh, it like clasped shut, it's like gold, pretty, really, really luxurious. 
So these are like two highlighters, eyeshades, which kind of look like eyeshadows, which I guess the eye part. So yeah, I am curious about this. Um, so this is like a really light bronzer. I don't even know if that would even work as a contour for me. So I'm definitely going to have to try this out because like these are very unique shades. Like I'll compare this to the Park Avenue Princess. Like, as you can see, like this one is clearly like a contour shade. Like right here, like this is definitely a contour shade because it has that gray undertone. Like this one right here is like very picky with contours. Um, it's almost like too light to be a contour. Oh, that's kind of crazy. It goes from like light to like super dark. I don't know. I really don't have an opinion on this quite yet. I'll try one of the highlighters on for you guys. So I feel like wasting your time. But it, these are so small, like they look like eyeshadows. So I'm gonna mix them together. I just feel like why even like get like a highlighter like you, here. Like, like I feel like honestly she could have like just added another bronzer here because it's just like these are basically eyeshadows. Yeah, I, I don't really have an opinion. I feel like it's just okay as of right now, but like I will have to like actually play with it. It seems like a lot going on. There's a lot going on. A lot going on. So that's done with the makeup for once. So I'm gonna jump into clothes. So I picked up this uh, top from Beachy. How long I'm gonna show you this, guys? Because I really don't want to, like, honestly, like, actually get up and like do things. So this is like a long top from Beachy. It's really soft. Beachy's like expensive, not gonna lie, but their stuff is like really good quality. It's pale pink. It's like long. Be good with like leggings or jeans, good for work. So nothing too exciting, but it's just super, super soft. Um, I also picked up, I don't even know if I want to show you guys to be honest, because I'm not like that into showing my body. I'm pretty so so this, whoa, as you can see. So this is the so this is whoa, this is the little <laughs> align uh <laughs> this is the Lula Lemon Align sports bra and I gotta say that I got it in the size six and it was on sale and this is the Align sports bra. So it's really pushes the girls up as you can see what's happening. Um and I gotta say that the Amazon dupe for this is like an exact dupe and it's way cheaper. Like I have it in pink. Like seriously, this is like $20. Um, and I have it in also green. So honestly, like I really feel like the Amazon dupe is exactly the same. And I kind of want to return this one, but I'm like, because this one's like $68, not on sale. So I'm like, that one's like $20. It's literally the exact same thing. I haven't worked out in this yet, but I don't know. So that's what I picked up from the Lemon as well as these Align pants. So I love the Align pants. Like they feel like nothing. Honestly, there has never been like any pants that fit like these like they feel like skin honestly they are like a hundred dollars but i've had the same ones for like years i get it in the size six and it's just like this like gray with kind of like grayish i don't know I, I have i have it in purple no i have it in i have a pair in navy black and now this color and i just love them for lounging around and just like they're just so comfortable like just ridiculously comfortable um, jumping back to Beachy, I don't know why I got on Beachy. So I picked up, whoa, get it up later. So I picked up this top, it's like a pink, cute top. It's really tangled. So this is like a kind of like a billowy fit. I think this video's going to be a mess, guys. Oh my goodness. I might just link everything down below so you can see what it looks like on a model. It's not, not a model. So this is like a cute top. You wear with jeans. It's like billowy. This is actually a small. It's actually brighter in real life, but I'm just like a good summer top, really light. Um, What else? I picked up this sweatshirt from Beachy, which is super cute. It is, I love this sweatshirt. It's super soft. I do get a medium, so it's like a little oversized. And this is from Lulu Simone Studio. And it is the sweater in 
It's a streamer. So soft. It has like an inner lining that's like really soft. Like it has like one of those like soft linings, which I adore. So this is super cute. I love like neutral colored sweaters. I'll link that down below as well. Hopefully you can still get your hands on it. And Oh, I also, I forgot to mention the Chance Chanel perfume. That's what I picked up from the, from the Sephora sale. So I love this perfume. That's what I was talking about. Like, I adore it. This is U Tendre pink perfume. It just smells like spring. Love it so, so much. Amazing perfume. Like, it's the best. Back to clothes. So I picked up this, like, crop top, this, like, floral crop top. And it is so cute. Um, so you can kind of clasp in the front and it's it's just cute and it's just really good for summer and this is more of like definitely would not wear this to work so um like that <laughs> just like that it's like literally fabric so um yeah you tie in the front it's like you just tie in the front and it's like floral and stuff I'll like link it down below guys I'll link it down below I'm not like doing a try on video right now and nobody got time for that. So I'm going to jump into Shein. I'm going to jump into Shein fast. We're going to jump in. So I haven't tried any of this stuff on. So this is just like my first impression. Shein is super cheap. So I picked up this workout. Like these are basically biking shorts. But they have like that scrunching in the back. It's like super in on TikTok or whatever. Um, it was, this is a medium in the brown. So I will be trying this. I'll let you know if I like it or not. In the down box below. I've been obsessed with swimsuits, so I picked up this swimsuit. It feels really cheaply made. I'm not going to lie. This is the top. It's like cheetah print. It feels really cheap. I picked up the bottoms, and also feels really cheap. It also looks dirty. Upsetting. I picked up this really cute shirt that was like $5, so... I just think this is really good for bed, like an oversized tie-dye shirt is like $5, so can't get too many tees. I also picked up this like dress. It actually looks like a swimsuit cover up now that I'm like holding in my hand. Just like a cute dress for summer, just something light. I'll bow that on. And I also picked up another swimsuit. This one looks a little bit better quality. And this is the top here. And it's just like this really cute, like blue bandeau here. Hopefully it fits over my boobs. Really cute. And I got the matching bottoms as well. Um, and I just want to shout out like this really cute tennis shoe that I bought from Amazon. So I got these tennis shoes from Amazon. They're so cute. Usually I get Adidas or Nike. I just like didn't feel like, I feel like the Adidas are so hard to buy because like their sizing is so confusing. And I just, I've had Nike forever. This is from the brand Asics. And these are so comfortable and so cute. So I will link them down below if you're looking for a new pair of tennis shoes. And hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it's like super all over the place, kind of jumping around. Um, but I just want to get out there when I got the time. So I really, I just don't have, a lot of time with the new puppy working full time and like we have some friends who are staying with us this weekend and like this I just gotta make the time when I make the time so it is what it is so hope you guys enjoyed please like and subscribe once again and I love you guys so so much for joining me in the scatterbrained haul so there it is